Hello, welcome, welcome to, to the graduated, graduated voice updates. updates. Be ready for the real tea. Details to tell. While concerning the latest updates concerning Pastor Ezekiel Odero, he has made things clear concerning his relations to Pastor Mackenzie in regard to the Shakahola matter. And as we dive into that, I really appreciate it. If you like this video, you can share us out there, tell someone about this channel, and let's catch up as i give you more updates the world the pastor has refuted claims of a close working relationship with the good news international cult leader paul Ndenge mackenzie pastor Ezekiel told the senate adhoc committee investigating the shakahola massacre that the only time he interacted with mackenzie was when he attempted to acquire his television air waves and concerning his unexplained world, the pastor said that he owns uh, all that he owns, including his wristwatch, comes from offerings by his over 45,000 congregants. Well, in regard to that matter concerning world, it has brought about different reactions among netizens. Some people saying that they are not false. So let me just read out two or three from the people, as you can also tell me what is your regard into this matter in the comment section. Uh, like the ma maid of Iron Mulek Lonzo says, see your pastor, he has used your money, the money you thought you gave God to build an international school. I'm sure the parents in his church can't afford to take their children in that school. Still, you want me to believe you have a God in the sky. The medic uh, here says, the medic case here says that the government should consider taxing churches that collect more than they can utilize. That's why those flashy pastors are rushed to purchase private jets worth billions of shillings. As for Pastor Odero, he's good, a good man of God. There you have it. Talk to me in the comment section and tell me what is your regard to that. Let me just quote part of his words, a quotations, in my ministry, I preach live but use recorded programs at night. I do that because it makes it easier for someone to ask questions about what I preach, end of quotation. Well, the committee that is investigating deaths in the Shakahola massacre is expected to release its reports on Thursday, October 19th, 2023, that is this year. Talk to me in the comment section and remember if it's happening, I know all about it and if I know all about it, I'll tell you all about it so you can like the video, share out there subscribe for more and let's catch up on the next update